welcome back. This is Ballisco with an episode of Let's Play Final Fantasy 3. I'm joined, as always, by my trusty squad of Abel, Novin, Bloon, and Sackman. When we last left off, we had reached this place here, where we are told Zandy is. We used all the fangs. We're, we're ready to go. Ready to do this. We are, we've made it to the ancient maze. The ancient's maze, I should say. I'm just gonna bust on through the door. Screw walking around. I'm done walking around. Is that crystal music that I hear? I hear crystal music. It is crystal music. What is this? The, the earth? Earth crystal? It's kind of brownish to me. It is the earth crystal. That's what I said. Uh oh. By Master Zandy's orders. You will be crushed! Who? Who's that it? Is it someone nice? It's never someone nice. In fact, it's another Dark Elf. This one with silver hair. This is Titan. Okay, we'll go with Titan. Sure, why not? Let's go for Aeroga again. Nothing was working for me. Aeroga was definitely working for me. We're taking it on. Yeah, I got him with the Dragon Lances now. This guy does hit pretty hard, though. He does not like Novin. We're going to use Earth Magic on him. Yeah, it did pretty damn well, didn't it? 5,000 damage. And this is supposed to be his element. Go, Aroga. Almost 2,000. Not bad, not bad. Another 2,000 damage in there. Let's go for terrain. And you just... Kira, Nova, there we go. Go, Wind Slash. See, that would be more his, his weakness, even though, once again, he does not have a weakness. Go, Kira. 1100. Almost full. Almost full. Seriously? Why do you hate Novin, Titan? Ah, oh, thank you. You hate Abel a little bit, too. Oh, wow. Almost 7500 damage there. That is awesome. That is damn awesome. Okay. Now we can use a regular cure on everybody. You jump again. And he's not going uh, to... Sackman's not going to be able to absorb anymore, but, you know, should be fine. <laughs> Should be fine just with the damage that we're getting. Everybody's almost back to full once again. Not Novin because Titan hates Novin for whatever reason. 3400 and down goes Titan. And for that battle, we get 13,500 gil, 6900 experience. Level up for Abel. Level up for Novin. Lo job level up, a job level up, and a job level up for Bloom, and that's it. That's it. Once again, only high potions if you steal. Warriors of the Light! Sandy is using my powers for his own evil purposes. He is trying to engulf this world in darkness once again. I will bless you with my power. Use it to banish the darkness that threatens this land. The Circus Tower known to you mortals as the Crystal Tower, because circuses are made of crystals, was created so long ago out of solid light. Sandy has used this element against us and uses our power to bring forth the darkness. Warriors of the Light, seek out Sandy in the Circus Tower and stop his nefarious plan. Crystal Tower was definitely a better name than the Circus Tower. And we have been blessed with the power of Earth. We are now complete. And we have new job classes. Let's take a look at those. What are these new job classes? Holy crap, our screen is full. Okay. Uh, drinking Bart. Here we go. We have the Black Belt, the Devout, the Magus, the Summoner, the Sage, and the ninja. Which ones of these will I choose? Well, I don't know. I don't know right now. But I'll find out, and I will be right back with my new spiffy job classes. Okay, I've been doing quite a bit of job level grinding. Um, I ended up changing everybody's class to a final, um, final class, I should say. Because yeah, but I mean, because we've got all the job classes now, 
right? So this is going to be it. I have Abel as a ninja, job level 25. Novin is a magus. Mag I'm going to go with magus. Um, job level 22. Bloom is, de is a devout, job level 21. And Sackman is a black belt, job level 24. That's, that's basically what I've been doing. I went back to the original cave. Uh, do you guys remember the original cave that opened up the game? That's where I went and um, basically fought goblins and I just guarded for like five turns and then killed them off and then pretty much that ensured me a level, a job level up every battle. In terms of equipment, I do have the Kikuiji Mungies back on Abel uh, with all the Genji equipment, uh, rods and staves. Why did I not have a major of on him? As apparently I had a naked Novin while I was grinding. Uh, feathered hat, mage robe, protect ring, and you know, this is kind of useless. It does not matter. Uh, golem staves on bloon, feathered hat, white robe, diamond bracers, and on Sackman I got dark claws, metal knuckles, chakra band, black bow key, and diamond gloves. Okay, now we're finally ready to move on. I choose to go to right first. Um, I hope that I am a high enough job level so that I can continue to do damage. Up here, we do find an elixir, which is nice. Which is very nice. Okay, let's go up these stairs, and we're just going to continue on with the dungeon. After all, this is supposed to be a maze, right? The ancient's maze. And in here, we get Lilith's Kiss and a crystal shield, neither of which I'll probably ever use. But I'm going to keep going anyway. I need to keep going... And finally, there is a battle. I was about to say, are there any here? We do have... Uh, isn't this a zombie dragon? Uh, bone dragon, so this is different. Uh, now that Novin is no longer a geomancer, he has to use magic. I don't know what it is weak against, to be honest with you, but I will use fire. Go fire! And then since it is flying, I am going to use this opportunity to use Aeroga. And hopefully that will work out for the best. Come on, die. No, it's got over 10,000 HP, so this guy will never be a one-hit a quitter. Never be a one-hit a quitter. Go, fire, finish him off. Down he goes. Okay, so still one round. One round, which is nice. We get 7,800 gil, 2,850 experience, and do you, do you like Bloon's cat ears? Because uh, everybody wears cats, cat ears when they're, when they're devout. It's weird. Uh, for, <laughs> for that, though, we do get a, a, a crystal mail. I don't think anybody can equip that, though. Let me check. Uh, and they're the only, yeah, nobody can really wear mail right now, the way that this is set up. Um, but, you know, I, I like this setup. Up here we get another white musk. Um, I haven't used any of those, but those are, those are limited. You can't buy those, so always grateful to get one. Uh, crystal gloves. Now, gloves I know other people can wear. Let's see, can you equip the crystal gloves? No. You? No? Oh, come on, you can wear gloves. You cannot wear these gloves. What the hell, game? What the hell? Ugh. So we just go through here, through the not-so-secret passage, which leads us to the next room. And here I want to go, I think, down? I think down first? I'm not sure, though. Holy crap, what the hell? This is a Thanatos. Ugh. I don't like the looks of it at all, so we're going to cast Bio on it, which is somehow non-elemental in this game. Um, and, and kill it with fire, please. Uh, you can use boost on uh, your your black belt, and it'll boost his attack power. You can do that a maximum of two times. Uh, if you use it a third time in a row, uh, not only will it all be cancelled, but he'll hurt himself like for half his HP, I believe. So never use it three times in a row. Um, I do believe that like you can start getting massive amounts of damage with just one use of that uh, that boost and then one attack. You know, use two boost and then attack. That kind of things can do massive amount of damage. I hear, you know, legend has it that you can actually kill the final boss with with that. Uh, 
I have no idea whether or not that's true. Let's go for Thundaga! You, once again, kill it with fire. This should be enough to finish it off right here, though. Down it goes. I was about to say, unless this is going to be very powerful. Powerful enemies that we're fighting here. We get 5,000 gold, 2,850 experience. Hold on while I do uh, heal. I was about to say save. No, we, have, we need to heal. Actually, I was wrong. We need to go to the right first. Yeah, because there's a treasure chest right there with a crystal helm. Once again, I don't think anybody can equip the crystal material, so I'm just going to keep going then. Just ignore that. Um, we'll go down first. <gasps> no, I'm so lost. Oh, there's treasure chest, so I went the right way. We find Chocobo's Wrath in here and another fight. What is this going to be? A preemptive strike against an upgraded demon. This is a greater demon. Um... You freeze demons, I swear you do. I swear you freeze demons. Hopefully I can get him uh, dead. I can kill him in this one round so that he never gets an attack off. But I don't know if I'm going to be able to do that. We're getting massive amounts of damage in on him though. These, these battles are not pushovers. Seriously, are the rods really that weak now? But down he goes. Okay, so rods are damn near useless now. You get 4,800 gil, 2,850 experience, a level up for Sackman, and a job level up for Sackman. Always, always good. Job levels will increase your um, damage and all that kind of stuff, so job levels are always good. Break blade? What is that? Is that going to be an upgrade for a ninja? He's very... No. Damn you! <laughs> nah, I didn't think so. Alright, so, cannot use the break blade. That's okay. We'll just keep going then. It's not like we're having too much trouble with these fights anyway. Another new fight? These are like upgraded. Una Unai's clone, okay. They're not even hiding it. They're just like, yeah, this is a clone. What are you going to do about it? Uh, we're going to go for Aroga. Um, because, yeah, the, the rods are not doing anything. And Aroga does do quite a bit of damage. Quite a bit of damage. As much as Thundaga, we will see. Go, Thundaga! Almost 2,800 damage. But Sackman might finish Unai's clone off right now. Down it goes, so we don't even get to see the Aroga. 8,500 gil, 3,600 experience, and we are moving on. We are going to go to the right, and then up. Where will this take us? Uh, around to a dual Hawken. I don't know what that is either. Sounds like, sounds like it could be a blade or a boomerang, but they're telling me no. Yeah, I didn't figure. Okay, I give. What is it? Obviously, uh, the break blade was a blade, but what is this? Dual Hawken. Uh, apparently, everything's out of order now. Where is it? There it is. It's an axe. So if you have a, a Viking, that'll probably be an upgrade for you. I forget who else can use it. I think the Dragoon can use No. Dark Knight, maybe, could have used the, the axe. I don't think the Dragoon could. So we're going to just keep going. Just keep running. And running around try to get through this dungeon will there be another new enemy no keep going pretty much the only way we can go to another battle that was kind of quick because this guy again continuing on we are headed up and then to the right you know there's there's not much variation here we're just trying to get through the dungeon uh here we get another phoenix down always appreciated we might need to use those eventually Continuing through the zigzag. Uh, I am not liking the zigzag. Couldn't I have gone just right until until I made it? But we do get a protect ring out of there. I don't remember if I need to equip that on anybody or not. Do you have one? You do and you don't, meaning you do need one. Sweet. So there is an upgrade. We finally did get an upgrade. Okay, here we get a holy lance. Nobody can use lances anymore. I do not have my dragoon. But 
he would definitely equip it if I did still have him. And Hellish Claws! There we go. There's an upgrade I could use for attacking. I bet those are upgrades. Yeah, even from there. And they inflict poison, so total of up about... Uh, I don't even know. I, was <laughs> I wasn't keeping track. That was definitely up by a lot. Let's just keep going then. Up through here. Uh, by at least, yeah, attacked by at least 15, and we've made it to the Crystal Tower, which we will have to take on next time. I hope you guys have enjoyed this part of Let's Play Final Fantasy III. I've been joined, as always, by my faithful squad of Abel, Novin, Bloon, and Sackman. Hope you guys have enjoyed this part. Hope you laughed. Hope you learned. Hope to see you next time. Thanks for watching.